Hi, my name is Sylvia Kenmere. I'm a board certified entomologist. Bed bugs have become one of the top pests. Being able to recognize, monitor, and treat for bed bugs is very important, and in this video, we will cover how to do that. Bed bugs are a small insect. The adults are about the size of an apple seed. All stages of bed bugs, except for the eggs, feed on blood. They are a cryptic pest, meaning they like to hide in small cracks and crevices, and usually they are nocturnal. Tools that can help with inspection include a small card, such as a credit card, a flashlight, gloves, and vials or baggies to collect the bugs you have found. Inspect all areas of the room and be sure to check underneath items looking for actual bed bugs or signs of bed bugs, which can include dead skin casts and excrement or poop, which looks like black dots or blood spots. Be sure to focus on all cracks and crevices. Bed bugs typically prefer wood surfaces over metals, but be sure to look everywhere during your inspections. As you can see, this is a straightforward green protocol that you can use to manage bed bugs in hotels, hospitality, and housing. Using a pest control vacuum like the Atrix Ergo Backpack Vacuum can remove live bed bugs immediately and can also help in removing dead bed bugs after treatments. It is not recommended to use a regular vacuum as the filters are not made for insect removals and you can spread bed bugs to other rooms or locations. The Pulte Cymex Eradicator kills bed bugs and eggs on contact with 356 degrees superheated dry steam. The steam head should be moved at a speed of two to three inches per second. There is almost no moisture, no added chemicals to the steamer, just water. When used as directed, the steam will not damage surfaces and there is no waiting time after treatment. Rooms can be occupied immediately. If bed bug activity is detected, here are some steaming basics. Start with the bed, then gradually work outwards. Here are some areas to inspect and treat. The mattress, box spring, bed skirt, bed frame, headboard, baseboard, lamps, phones, television, curtains, nightstand, dresser, upper trim, wallpaper edges, desk chairs, bathroom, vents, ceiling, plumbing, thermostats, clothes rods, shower rods, carpet edges, closet shelves, TV remote, coffee makers. While there are many places you can steam, do not use on live electronics or battery operated electronics such as laptops. Consult the instruction manual for more information. After the steam treatment, because the moisture is so limited, there is no added cleanup. You may need to clean up the dead bed bugs and an Atrix vacuum is ideal for dead bed bug cleanup. Be sure to read the manual on the disposal of the dead insects. For extra protection, we recommend that you use a mattress or furniture encasement. Encasements cover the entire mattress or box spring and have locking mechanisms to ensure bed bugs cannot escape. The clean cover encasement by Mattress Safe has been tested by experts and is used by pest management professionals. If you don't see any bed bugs, you can consider monitoring. If you have alive or dead bugs, we recommend that you start treatment. Monitoring is an important part of an integrated pest management program. It is simple, cost-effective, and proactive, and will help you determine what pests you might be dealing with, including bed bugs. Monitoring helps collect and trap pests for not only the initial identification, but to evaluate how successful your treatment is. Knowing what pest you might be dealing with as early as possible is key to any successful integrated pest management program. 
Monitors also help you understand whether your treatment was successful and can help you with visual documentation showing that bed bugs have not been detected in the room after treatment. With difficult or widespread pest infestations, you may need to consider consulting a licensed pest management professional. Please read all of the labels and instructions for all of the products mentioned today. And if you have any questions, please refer to the manufacturer's websites.